good morning friends and welcome to our Polish series to today so today we are in Zakopan Poland and I took Adam here to celebrate his birthday so he loves skiing and I've never done skiing before so I hope you guys enjoy this trip now we're just gonna walk around the town and look to find a place that I can do some ski lessons for today because we're only here for four days so we need to find some ski lessons for myself as soon as possible. We are also staying at the Radisson Blue Hotel here in Zakopan, which was built in 2019. So it's a pretty new hotel and I can't wait to take you guys on this adventure. Ciao! Guys, the Radisson Hotel is so beautiful in Zakopane. I totally am obsessed with the bedroom and you have all the rooms to put all your skiing equipment. It also has an inside pool area and heated jacuzzi. It was so damn lush. The first day, we just had an amazing relaxing day using the hotel facilities. But then the next day, we was off to finding some skiing location for me to train. We walked around Zakepane town and we went to the famous Zakepane sign which I highly recommend. There was so much ice and snow. It was super pretty for me. I think this was the most snow that I've ever seen. Make sure and stay to the end of the video to see the total price that we paid for this skiing trip for four days in Zakepane, Poland. We just came to this vegan cafe that Adam found um, while Googling a vegan place and I'll like put the name of it up on screen for you guys but it's a super cool cafe and it's gonna close shortly however the views and everything is so amazing you can see like the entire view of the mountains here just show you guys kind of stunning view And I got um, a cauliflower soup. Adam got the cauliflower soup as well, and it tastes so delicious. I'm almost finished my bowl. And then I got an oat coffee. If you are gonna get the oat coffee, do ask them to put an additional shot in there because it's super weak. And we also got a vegan chocolate cake. Just right here. Looks delicious. Can't wait to try it. It's chocolate cake. Mm. Doesn't even taste vegan. <laughs> I'm gonna get up and show you guys more of the view and Zakapan like my review of Zakapan it is so pretty like there's snows everywhere and it's surrounded by mountains we had a really late start of the day today because we woke up really late however I can't wait to show you guys tomorrow i will be going ski training so i'm super excited for that so yeah this is the cafe it's a pretty cool little cafe in the town so we now leave in the strh bistro cafe so it's a vegan cafe the food was delicious i highly recommend if you are coming to zakapan do visit this cafe if you are vegan or if you want to try vegan food I highly recommend like where the cafe is situated as well it's pretty cool like they have some amazing art pieces on the wall as well so definitely I would say come to see this cafe if you are gonna visit Zakopan so at the moment I have to look for a makeup store because I forgot my makeup brush to do my makeup or to put on my foundation and at the moment i have on no foundation and it's annoying me because i do want to dress up in the night so we're gonna find a place a cosmetic place to get that and then we're probably gonna walk around zakopan some more and then head back to the hotel 
get ready and tonight this cafe is having a jazz concert so potentially we are planning to come to that jazz concert tonight skiing lessons was so scary but i did amazing so i had three days of skiing lessons and on my second day i was off and ready to go skiing on my own my instructor said like i did well for a first time skier so definitely next year i'll be skiing again Adam was really good at skiing even though he haven't done it in 12 years. After skiing for the whole day, we went to have dinner in a local restaurant and Polish people eat super heavy. There was a lot of like Polish dumplings, a lot of like Polish cheese. It was super heavy food. Like I was sick for most days with my stomach. The last day of our Poland trip, we went out to an amazing restaurant for Adam's birthday and we had Italian food. It was the most delicious Italian food I've ever had. <laughs> it's hard to open, isn't it? Uh -huh. That's why I made sure I stick it properly for you. What the hell is that? What did you do? Lick it? No. It doesn't have the rip thing like they normally do. It never does. I thought it did. At least when I got it. I think when you got mine, it has it. Yeah. But when where are you getting it? Funky pigeon again? I'm not telling you. Or moon pig? I always get moon pig. Moon pig doesn't do this. I fucking it. I can't get it. Could be the size. I can't. It's gone. together if you use this. <laughs> Did you mash it or something? No. It's a bit mashed in the corner. Is it like that? Behind? No, it wasn't. I oh, know, it's just the print, I think. <laughs> These are photos I don't know. Where's this one? That's my secret stash. <laughs> Where is this one? Which one? This one with me in the yellow shirt. Where's that? That's my shirt. secret stash. Of what? You just got photos of me? Oh wow, you do have a secret one. Why are you not showing something? Fuck off. Is that it? I'm not going to tell you. 
us, us traveling the world together. Overall, we had an amazing time in Poland and I highly recommend if you are looking for an affordable skiing trip, I recommend Zakepane Poland because it's such a beautiful town and super touristic.